Okay. <clears throat> All right, we got a PO battle against Xerxes. Um, I'm just gonna put like the live narration ones. I'm gonna have as like I don't know live narration PO, I suppose. But the ones where I actually go up my way to try and battle someone, I'll probably just put them in the actual backlog. Anyway. He has a team, but it's a team of teaminess, and I put my cuss Chopal Lax team and a smart oh yeah, P I wait, not P O. P S, that's it. Yeah, he's only out of row. I'm gonna go stealth rocks, he's gonna go wisp, but no my days, this thing's quick. Oh god, this would be fun. Um, I'm looking around and I'm trying to think actually I haven't watched this at all, so if I get something wrong, I get something wrong. Anyway, uh, I suppose I'm going to sack my Tyranitar just because I've already got sand up and that's, and rocks and he can't spin and overall with, you know, Heatran and Landorus, Sizzle, Rotom, Tyranitar's kind of shit, so I figured fuck it, I'll just get damage. He does miss a Hydro Pump, which is kind of irrelevant. The defense drop helped out a bit, but whatever, I'm going to go into Zapdos and I'm going to T-Bolt, because why the fuck not? And um, he's going to switch out and go into Heatran, and I get a Parahax. And I think you'll all agree that that's a bit lame. But there we go. Hacks is hacks, I suppose. Uh, he goes Lava Plume, gets the burn, which is fair dues. In comes uh, Sizzle. Um, I, yeah. Why, I have no real reason not to go for Heat Wave. I mean, whatever. Zapdos is bulky enough. I suppose I go into Militech to take a Bullet Punch. Uh, see, I missed this style of narration where I just sort of try and awkwardly flow things together as I see it and maybe make random guesses on what I'm doing. So yeah, uh, Heatran's here, Militech's here, uh, I go Toxic predicting a switch, he doesn't switch, he goes Stealth Rocks and now I can Scald. And he protects. You know, what is that? Stealth Rock, Lava Team, Protect, probably Toxic. And Scald, yeah, Toxic. Scald literally does nothing. That Heat Train is so bulky. And he's going to go in a Rotom. And I Scald, and uh, that doesn't do much either. Um, I'd like to get a rest up on Militech. He's going to go Pain Split, and I do get a rest. Yeah. So, now Militech should be able to handle most threats on his team, maybe, apart from the Dragonite. Dragonite isn't looking very good, but we'll see how we go on that. Either way, I'm going to go back into Zapdos, because I figure I might be able to get a Roost in somewhere, maybe? I kind of need to, otherwise Zapdos is kind of bone, but in comes a Gengar, and it's not looking too good now. And he shadow balls and kills me. And he's life orb. Uh, that's not great. But I think an eight. Dogtrio, cool beanies. I couldn't be asked to try and send in Clodol because I knew I was going to die. But I go Stone Edge and I actually hit. So, well, hey. Thank you, Mr. Stone Broadside. Um, now, things are looking kind of iffy here because, like I say, I haven't got a Sash. Uh, he has a Scizor. And Dogtrio uh, has the defenses of a menopausal woman. So, in comes the Scizor. And I. I, that's not great. So I'm going to go to Militech. He's going to go U-turn. And bad things. Bad things. He switches out and goes to his Dragonite. And again, something Militech can't really deal with. Although that said, he does have Lefty. So if, if I could scold and get a burn, but I don't want to do that, I'm going to go into Dog Cherries. He goes DD. Yeah. Now, here comes the tricky thing. Because he's, he, he, he's quite fond of bulky Dragonites. So I was thinking, oh, Stone Age doesn't get anywhere near killing it. And now we have a rather tricky problem here. Um, I believe he sees that he can live another one, so he's going to go DD again. Now, he was expecting me to Stone Edge or EQ, but I was expecting him to attack them thinking he would think that. Ah. Because EQ or Stone Edge wouldn't do enough, even if he roosted. So it was literally Sucker Puncher, I'm done. So I went for it, and I, it paid off, and that was like a 10% shot at killing his Dragonite, because logic dictated he was going to roost, because he could. But... Mysteriously, it worked out. Like I say, he really should have just roosted. He would have been champion. But, oh well. Ingram says, oh, I'm going to go Militech because Militech lolls in this thing's face because it's so bulky. Um, in comes Rotom. I sleep talk. Get a Toxic. That's good. It just means it's going to die a bit quicker. Um, and I think I'm just going to, you know, let Militech die. But, um,. He uh, goes Hydro Pump predicting the switch, probably to Claydol or Dogtrio or anything, really. 
Um, that's fine, and now he bolts it out, and now goes Militic, and, um, yeah. Good, good things. Uh, in comes Sizzle. And I go into Snorlax. I blame my Snorlax, like, really badly. I'm pretty sure I do. Do I? Do I? No, come on, you're going into it. There you go. Yeah, I figured that he would realise I have Chopal, since I know he watches my stuff. I figured he'd realise since I have Chopal that he pro I well, I figured he'd go into Rotom, but he doesn't. He superpowers, and I body slam, and he doesn't, yeah, he doesn't even go anywhere near Rotom, and that's bad. So I'm going to switch out, and I'm going to go to Claydol, because it's cool now, and that's fine. And, um... It looks banded, and uh, he's gonna go in a heat tran as I go psychic. Whatever, that's fine. Um, and I believe I go, yeah, I'll go off power, kill that. That's good. That's gone well. Oh, I don't even remember what happens now. I really, I, I lost all recollection of this battle. The only thing I remember was I bogged up on the Snorlax, and that Dolcho Sucker Punch was huge, like massive. But I'm gonna go to Snorlax because I'm gonna sack it. And he does miss another Hydro Pump. In fact, he misses another, another Hydro Pump. And you see, I said that mattered because that gives him an extra turn to fuck around with. You know, he wouldn't have died to the Toxic and the Sand. So, he could have, I don't know, I would have had to go into Dolcio. I might have missed the Stone Edge. He could have Pain Splitted. Millions of things happen, but Fearimon is Fearimon. So, uh, he's going to go into his Life Orb, Sheer Force, Landorus. And I go into Claydol and... Claydol was like, lol in your face. Hidden power ice, bitch, I have ice beam. So now goes that. And uh, it comes down to this. Can um, Sizzle kill me? And uh, he bullet punches me. And I go into Dodgeo. And he bullet punches and kills that. I believe. Does he? I'm pretty sure he does. Oh, nice no, like punch and I kill. Hey! Alright, that's good game. So I hope you really enjoyed the really, really, really quick narration. And blah, blah, blah. blah, blah. See you guys in a bit. <sighs> Peace.